Cowabunga! Let's kick off this epic haul with this Ooze Cruisin' figure set. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles! Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles! Heroes in a Half Shell! Holy freaking turtle power! Packed in a mighty stylin' Turtles Pizza Fire Van, this Ooze Cruisin' figure set features the entire Turtles team. That she sounded like a leader. I do? Oh, I do! Oh, I sound like such a leader! And you ruined it. So what if nobody takes him seriously? Four and a half inch Leonardo, the leader, features a highly stylized comic look inspired by the movie. Here's his turtle shell with sheath that holds his katanas. Leo's ready for battle with his iconic twin katana. Each turtle has 12 articulation points for action-packed battle poses. His head's on a ball joint, so he moves left and right, has some backward and forward movement, and some head pivot. He has arm rotation, and his arms pivot outward. He has a single jointed elbow. There's rotation at the elbow and wrist. His legs have a ball joint so they move backward and forward. His legs pivot outward and there's thigh rotation. There's a single jointed knee. There's rotation at the knee and his ankles simply rotate. Enough talk! I dream about fighting every night! You've got a rage oh, problem, right? Snap. It's not a problem! Is it me or does 4.6 inch Raphael look a bit angry? It's no wonder they call him the angry one. He has loops for his size. Raph even has a battle scar, perhaps from a training accident. Raph includes his signature twin side. Hey guys, if we weren't monsters that were shunned by society and we could do what we wanted, what would you guys do? Maybe get a girlfriend? Not likely. Mikey's the comedian. Too bad his brothers don't think he's that funny. He's got a big smile from ear to ear. And he has storage for his weapons. Michelangelo is battle ready with his iconic nunchucks, but they're loose in his hands. Our dad is definitely not a giant rat. That makes me feel like he's a rat. Featuring a light green shade, 4.5 inch Donatello is literally the brains of the turtles. He has his signature purple bandana and coordinated accessories. Fanny pack with a smartphone sticking out, which is removable. Like the movie, Donnie wears glasses, and they're removable. He's got his iconic bow staff, but it's not painted. Let's store Donnie's bow staff on the back of his shell. Voiced by Seth Rogen, 4.5 inch Bebop, a half human, half warthog mutant, looks freaking amazing. In addition to his movie inspired outfit with exclusive green ooze splatter, he's got on his cool signature purple shades. But surprisingly, he's got no eyes underneath. Ah! Did Raph rip off Bebop's mom tattoo and put it on backwards to prove his toughness? Check out the details in his powerful Bebop drill gun. Man, that looks dangerous. Bebop's head swivels. His shoulder pads limit his arm movement. They also move outward. He has a single jointed elbow and his wrists rotate. Unfortunately, there's no waist articulation. He has leg, knee, but no ankle movement. This is insane. Turtle, mutant, karate teens. I want to know everything about you. Roughly four inches tall, April O'Neil, the turtle's friend, is exclusive to this set for now. April's wearing her movie-inspired outfit with her iconic yellow jumpsuit and cool white and red kicks with black laces. She includes a bag accessory. With a ball-jointed head, April can move her head quite a bit. She has shoulder and elbow movement, but no wrist movement. Her legs are on a ball joint. She has knee movement and her feet rotate. What the? Y'all some little tortoises, huh? I can't believe there are other mutants! Voiced by Ice Cube, 4-inch Superfly, the fly guy, who's half man, half fly, looks pretty freaking badass. He's one cool-looking villain that leads a gang of mutants. He's a highly intelligent humanoid fly. Superfly has lived in hiding his entire life, slowly amassing power in the criminal underworld. But freaking check out that massive clawed arm! And he even has little arms coming out of his body. What? Notice he has only one white shoe stuck on his leg. What kind of freakish beast is this anyway? Superfly's got his powerful blue blaster weapon with some nice little details. Plus, he includes this weapons rack loaded with accessories. Superfly's head moves left and right and up and down. His left arm moves backward and forward and outward. He has elbow movement and rotation. His right arm moves backward and forward and outward. His claw fully rotates. His legs move backward and forward. And there's thigh rotation. He has a knee joint and rotation. Michael Angelo, you have heart. Donatello, 
You have wisdom. Raphael, you have bravery. And Leonardo, honor. Played by the legendary Jackie Chan, 4-inch splinter Master Sensei is the turtle's radical rat dad slash sensei. Sensei, master, mutant, rival, rat dad. Of all his many roles, Splinter has most cherished being a father. Concealed inside his walking stick, Splinter includes his sword. He also includes a weapon track. Splinter's head swivels left and right. His arms move backward and forward and pivot outward. He has a joint at the elbow and rotation at the elbow and wrist. His legs go backward and forward and there's thigh rotation. He has ankle movement up and down and rotation. His tail moves left and right. Voiced by John Cena, 4.25 inch Rocksteady, a mutant rhinoceros, looks nicely detailed with a great sculpt and paint. Built like a tank, Rocksteady's here mutant muscle. Whether it's from his fists or his horn, you don't want to take a hit from this guy. He and Bebop make a dangerous duo, but their brains are what some may consider small, even for morons. Rocksteady's got his powerful blaster that's nicely detailed. Additionally, he has this weapons rack loaded with various accessories. Rocksteady's head swivels left and right, but it looks weird since it breaks up the skull. His arms move backward and forward and pivot outward. He has elbow and wrist movement. His legs move backward and forward, and there's thigh rotation and knee movement. 4.5-inch Leatherhead, the raging mutant Cajun gator with an Australian accent, looks awesome with a fantastic sculpt and paint and an outfit worthy of the Outback. Leatherhead's proud to be a mutant and all in on Superfly's plan to make more of them. They're down for causing destruction and mayhem, especially if it means getting to make a few big boombas. She's even got a holster for her shotgun with nice details. She has a fully loaded weapons rack loaded with various accessories. Leatherhead moves left and right, somewhat up and down, and there's head pivot. Too bad she can't open her mouth. Her arms move backward and forward and outward. She has elbow movement and rotation at the elbow and wrist. There's a hinge at the wrist. She rotates at the waist. Her legs somewhat move backward and forward and pivot outward, and there's thigh rotation. She has a knee joint and rotation at the ankles. Her tail moves left and right, and there's rotation. Before they became ninjutsu experts, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles were fumbling, bumbling turtle tots who were always causing havoc and driving Splinter nuts. Aren't they so cute? He moves his head. His arms move backward and forward and outward. He has waist movement, but no foot movement. Kawa fucking bunga! I love this collection. All right, collectors, what TMNT Mutant Mayhem collectibles will you be adding to your collection?